What's up you guys, it's back 2 k one and today I'm going to be doing a review on the basic series something. I think, like, what series is this? Well, yeah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I'm an idiot, but it's whatever series, first time in the line, Dean Ambrose. I have been searching this figure for so long now. Like, seriously, my stores in, like, where I live, I'm not saying my location, because I'm not an idiot. Well, I can't, wh whatever. The point is, you can't, f I can't find this figure anywhere. Like, where I live, you can't find it anywhere. Like, this figure is a really hard one to come by in my area. But, I went to Kmart, this was the last one they had. I was so happy when I dug this out. Like, this was in the, uh, display stand. Of the WWE section in, uh, you know, my, uh, yeah, basically my Kmart. But I'm gonna be reviewing it today, cause, well, I don't know. I don't know, I just feel like it. So here's the back of the box. They basically had, at my Kmart before I found this Dean Ambrose, they had Big Show, Dolph Ziggler, Kali, and CM Punk. And I was so pissed off they did not have them until I went to the display stand. And even then, they still didn't have Tamina Snuka. But I don't really care about Tamina. All I care about, Dean Ambrose. I could have sworn I just heard a yell. Well, anyway. Um. I apologize if you hear any meowing in the back. My cat is a stupid idiot. But. Yeah, so, uh, I'm gonna be reviewing it, so, let's get this guy out of the packaging. So, I wanna be kinda careful with this one, actually. Screw the packaging all up. Uh, just put that on, I guess. All right. So. Here is my favorite member of the shield out of his packaging. First look at it, this figure is super badass, man. This is a really amazing figure. For like this first time in the line Dean Ambrose figure, this is a really nice figure. I already like the vest, like the they got the detailings in the vest all correct. You know, like John Moxley style hairdo, like Here's a close-up on the hair. You can see that very well done by Mattel. You can see all the hair right there. And, uh, this is great. His wrist look a, looks a bit off, doesn't it? But that's all right. Don't matter. See like the black gloves here. See, like the black wrist tape. He has nothing else. Like, he wears all black, so there's like. Yeah, there's not much to go over. The pants are actually really cool, too. You can see they're tucked into his boots right there. Not sure what. Yeah, so. Here's the. Oh, sorry. Here's the uh, vest, you can get a close up right there. Here's a couple buckles and pockets right there. Looks like a black undershirt right there. There is actually a shirt under this vest. But there's only one, one problem. You can't really unattach this vest, like this is just like, this just comes on, you can't take it off. Cause Dean Ambrose doesn't even wear the vest on TV anymore, he just wears a black spandex shirt or whatever. But I like it this way better. Uh, so I'm not gonna cut it off or whatever. I'm just gonna keep it like this, cause 
well, it just, I don't know, Dean Ambrose was better without, like, you know, he was better with the vest on. So I'm not going to cut it off like an idiot. So, yeah. Let's go over the articulation real quick. So he has leg articulation in both legs. His knee articulation. And swivel the foot and the actual foot you can move up and down. His uh, waist movement. There's not too much of it though because of his vest probably. He has uh, arms up and down, arms upwards. You got the uh, upper arm, elbow. You can swivel the wrists. And uh, I want to mess with the hand movement too much. And then there's a uh, head movement. So, yeah. So, yeah. Well, let me get a close up on the back of the vest real quick. You can see all the detailings in there. They got a lot of detail in there. It's perfectly correct. So, yeah. This is definitely one of my favorite Mattel figures that Mattel has ever released. Um, definitely pick up this figure or its elite figure. Like, they are coming out with another Dean Ambrose, except he does not have um, white wrist tape. Like, no, he doesn't have black wrist tape. He has white wrist tape, and he has a, his, uh, a different head scan. And he comes with Seth Rollins and a two-pack with the United States Championship belt. How do I know this? Well, I saw a pic of it, so there you go. So, I have one member of the Shield right now, because I'm kind of slow with collecting figures nowadays, because, you know, Christmas is coming up. And I'm kind of slowing down with figure collecting, so if you don't see a review, like a wrestling, like if you don't see reviews, then that's the reason why. I'm kind of breaking on uh, figures, like I'm kind of breaking on buying figures because Christmas is coming up and, you know, I am may as well save a little bit of money. So, that's it. Like I said, this is probably my favorite Mattel figure one of my favorite Mattel figures, like, this might be my favorite, I just, like, don't remember the rest. Pro this would probably be tied with Elite 16 CM Punk, because that figure is pretty badass, too. And so is, like, a couple other figures I have. But, that's really it. Um, thank you for watching this, and, uh, we'll leave in the shield. See you guys later.